How you doing? This is Ivan from Bite Size Wisdom for Busy People, and I'm back to share another idea to help you live more consciously. Today our topic is on thought and our mental atmosphere. From the yogis we learn that thought is faster than the speed of light, and also that thought is finer than ether, ether being the medium of electricity. So we can think of our brains, our minds, being like wireless transmitters. So we're constantly sending and receiving messages. So if you are a person that has a peaceful inner space, then you are constantly sending out thoughts into the atmosphere that are peaceful. If you are a person that has an inner space full of anger, then you are sending out thoughts of anger. So it's important to know that your thoughts not only influence you, but can potentially influence your environment and have far and wide reaching influence. And this is interesting to see just whenever you go to a place where there's a lot of people and you may start to notice and see the mob mentality take place, start to take shape and that your own thinking starts to be influenced and you start becoming part of that mob mentality. So our thoughts do have power and they can permeate and travel through space. So a good way to think about how thought travels is just to imagine a big lake and if you throw a pebble or a stone in the lake and then the waves that ripple out much in the same way our thoughts are just rippling out into space and we learn from the yogis that the medium through which thought travels is called manas. Manas is a Sanskrit word that describes an aspect of consciousness and here manas pervades all of space and is the medium through which thought travels and with our bodies prana prana is you can think of it as the bioenergy in our bodies and it's the medium through which we feel and sound sound travels through air air is the medium for sound so it's important just to notice and know what our mental atmosphere is because as I said it's influencing the world around us so I recommend that you check out another video that I made it's a special meditation I'll put the link in the description and in this video I teach you about balancing and harmonizing your own little atmosphere and in this video I was just talking about thought but in your atmosphere it's composed of all the various energies not only our thought energy but our feelings and our body's energy and it's important that we balance this and also that we learn to insulate ourselves from other people's energies because if they're not conducive to the way that we want to be living or we don't want to be influenced in a negative way then we got to be able to create a little cocoon around us and conserve our energy and on a practical level everybody can relate to this as far as picking up on people's vibes so with this meditation it's going to be a way to have a good effect on the people around you you'll be sending out good vibes all right guys i hope you enjoyed that little short video wherever you are in the world i hope you're doing well and until next time Take care.